My name is Billy Lurk, though there aren't many people who remember. For years, I stayed hidden, captain of a ship called the Dreadful Whale. I was a smuggler, fence, and maybe traitor, depending on who you ask. Our names are always overshadowed by the words whispered after them. If you hide from the world long enough, eventually nobody remembers you. Then you're alone, living with your choices. But I could never forget the man who pulled me up from nothing. Dowd, the Knife of Dunwall. A name called out by the desperate or the dying. The assassin who ended one empress and saved another. Shame burns inside you for a long time. When I betrayed Dowd, he let me live. I left Dunwall and my own name behind. For years, I wondered if I was worth forgiving. For years, I laughed at myself for even wanting a killer's forgiveness. Sometimes mercy cuts deeper than any knife. Now I know that forgiving is something you do for yourself as much as for the people who hurt you. I know Dowd is in Karnaka, and I'm going to find him. Every night for weeks, the same terrifying dream. A street fight, my arm dead and lying in the gutter, my eye gouged out by a Grand Guard sword. But when I wake up, they still hurt for hours. Gives me the creeps. This always brought me a little comfort. You stole this for me, didn't you, Deirdre? Now it's all I have left of you. Another relic from the old days. Still holds an edge, at least. That boxing club in the Albarca Baths is my last lead. Dowd has to be there. I've been searching for months. I know you're here, Dowd. Somewhere. Burglary, spying, picking pockets. Dowd taught me more than just killing. It can keep me afloat, for now. This station hasn't been used for years. Hiding the dreadful whale wasn't easy, but it's safe so far. What can you tell me today, my little gutter friends? All right, the old Albarca baths shouldn't be far.
The yeah, I know what they're doing. That place reeks of black magic. You see the people who went there? Go after them and they'll curse your cod with pus blisters, if you're lucky. Ah, you and your superstitions. Don't believe all that hocus pocus crap. A gang's a gang. You should worry more about a knife in the back than some curse. If you say so. But let's still wait for the reinforcements. Could be a gimmick. But if they really do use magic, then I need to check it out. up your vitals gets the juices flowing through your veins do i know you for the fight. no of course not. you reckon i should get one no 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 don't waste coin on duff's whalebone gugas they don't do squat you'll need bone charms or potions or something if you plan on fighting tonight it's locked that area is Outsider's eyes. Dowd. They're making him fight. I have to get him out of there. You don't look so tough. Look at you. Trapped hey, like a hound in the pits. Hoping your masters will throw you a bone charm. This thing must be keeping Dowd's power suppressed. If I turned it off. Nothing could stop him. Just a little luck from the I'll get the cigars tomorrow. Wanna buy one? This bar is my place, not yours. Get out. Sign up to fight the brood over by the bookie cup. Get your sick of rip. It's a less painful death. This place really pulls in coin. I knife bigger blighters than him when I was a bottle street runner. And for less coin than I'll make when I win this match. You won't win. The brute cheats the eye with his speed. His moves are a blur. It's unnatural. Trust me, you won't land a blow. Nobody that fast. I'm feeling you, my friend. Yeah. 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 Yeah.
Doubt's never lost a fight. Beauty's ready for my fighting ring. Soon. I don't know how to spar yet. Loose the beasts and they savage anything that moves, friend or foe. I found an old beggar to train him up. Roots ripped it. Is someone asking for trouble? Huh? I don't like that. Better have a look. I don't know how to spar yet. Push the beast to the Good. We want them vicious. Find some more beggars to train them on. But keep a watchful eye when you're dumping the bodies next time. We don't need the guards sniffing around here again. Shown these posers a thing or two. Pull a body up from a morally bog after a year or two. See what that does to the skin and bones.
Again, show yourself. in the world. No use hiding. Live. I know this place like the back of my hand. Stay focused. Be what do you when want? You get in there. Up your agility right off and swing a hard left jab. Works like a charm. So many People trying to get away from Karnaka now. But where are you gonna go? There's money here. There. Even if it's dirty. I'm scared. Nothing I here. She'll show up again. I'm ready. <sighs> seek me out one day. I didn't think it would be like this. You were hard to find. How did you end up here? So let's talk somewhere else. The Eyeless have more secrets than you know. I've got a ship. Or what's left of it. The Dreadful Whale. It's docked below the Akintila repair station. Doubt I... Say whatever you want to say, Billy. That you're here now is enough. I need your help. Like old times? Those days are gone. This is something bigger. One last job. I can do it. 
Who's the Mark? The one responsible for it all. The cults. The black magic. This mark on my hand. We're gonna kill the black-eyed bastard himself. What? The... You want to kill the outsider? You want to kill God? I finally find him and the old man's got me jumping right back into this occult shit. <laughs> Dowd can explain himself back on the dreadful whale. knew a kid who said his bone charm would make bullets bounce off his skin. He shot himself in the stomach and died a day later. Only at the Spectre Club. I wonder if that's a private club for Eyeless members.
What the? Hidden forever. It looked like I don't know, but I saw something. Shit. When I first caught sight of Dowd, I was just a broken kid, staying alive out of spite. He cut the throats of three men without making a sound, leaving only blood and death in his wake. I don't know what I was hoping for when I followed him that night, but he shared his strange magic with me. And more than that, his skill, his time, his trust, and sometimes his secrets. Now he's not the man he was. Here in his final days, he's got wounds that won't ever heal and regrets as sharp as mine. I know how much that carves you up inside, but I found him, and he wants me to help him make up for a lifetime of sins by killing a god. The Abbey teaches us that the outsider preys on weakness, that the void is the source of doubt heresy, and suffering. That the outsider is to blame for all our ills. Who knows? Maybe they're right. The same dream. My arm hacked away. My eye hollow and burning. It still aches. Let's hope it's not some kind of omen. Let me tell you something about the void, Billy Lark. It touches the minds of the dreaming and the dying alike. And sometimes, dreams can only tell you what you wanted to forget. I know who you are. Why are you here? What do you want from me? People usually want something from me. What in the void? But you don't want my mark, do you, Billy? So I will return something you lost. Wait, what are you? Ah! The world was wounded around you. And you carry the scars. You will never be the same. I wonder if you'll like them. What did he do to me? Of course he shows up now. Shit! Shit! He took my arm! And my face! Is it because of the dreams? Or doubt? <laughs> 